Welcome to AH University, brought to you by Aggressive Hydraulics. Tony Kasasa, the Engineering Manager at Aggressive Hydraulics, leads this five-part series that will include the following topics, bearing and bushing basics, key characteristics, stress, types, and implementation. This video is the first segment of this series, focusing on the basics of bearing and bushing. So first question, what is a bushing or a bearing? So it's a wear surface. So that's exactly what it sounds like, a surface that's intended to be worn. They typically are replaceable. So if we think about a cylinder with a pin mount without a bushing, if that welded on lug gets worn, that lug is an integral part of the cylinder and would be fairly difficult to replace. Whereas a bushing or a bearing is something that is modular and can be taken out and a new one put in. Oftentimes they provide lubrication or provide a means to distribute lubrication. And so a typical application we're talking about for hydraulic cylinders is the pin mounts. Could be basin, could be rod in, could be both. All right, so what is the bearing? Talk about bushings and bearings. We're going to talk about bearings first. So a bearing is something that enables movement between two parts. So again, we're thinking about cylinders. We're thinking about pin mounts. So the cylinder is moving and whatever part of the machine is part of stationary. And so movement relative between the two of them. A bearing is something that is intended to reduce friction. And a bearing may be one part or it may be multiple parts. And we talk about bearings in our world and we're talking about pin mounts. We're talking about something that's round but there's also potential that a bearing could be something that's linear. So reducing friction, enabling the movement of something moving along a straight line. And so in our picture here, we have some things that are one piece, uh, like this one and this one and this one, and some that are multiple pieces, like this vertical bearing or this needle bearing or this ball bearing. A bushing is a type of a bearing, and it's described as something for a round hole especially one in which an axle revolves. So again, we think about our mount and we think about the pivot pin. So the bushing is in there to allow that to move. And then bushings specifically are designed as one part. So as the bearing can be multiple parts, the bushing is designed as a single. This concludes part one. Be sure to check out the remaining videos linked below. Contact us today to start your purpose-built process. Thank you.